peace. In, in a nice way. <laughs> Not in a nice way. <laughs> but we can't, ex we, when everyone else is portrayed so nicely, I can't expect that they've single one person out. So are you sort of an amalgamation of, you know, the, the village's conscien consciousness, really? Well, I think it's such a, in a, in a sense, a feel-good movie. If you remember the early 80s, which I do, I was a child at the time. Um, when those AIDS adverts came out, people were up in arms. People were scared to shake people's hands. I mean, it was a ridiculous reaction. But if you remember those adverts, I mean, it literally was, you are going to die. And you have to have that side of it in the film, otherwise it's... It doesn't have, you know, that that truth, which which was hugely, hugely uh, relevant in the day, especially in smaller communities, you know, where they didn't really have any contact with gay or lesbian people. So it was a scaremongering from the media. So that is kind of uh, crucial to, to portray, I think. And you've sort of actually got then the hardest part, maybe, because if you haven't got anyone to base yourself on, where does your research lie? I mean, did you still go through all of the old uh, papers and everything that were in the Welsh village and go back through the archives? or? I just remember how a lot of people I grew up with reacted to AIDS, reacted to gay people. Valley's people can be the warmest, kindest, most beautiful people in the world. But of course, like any community, you will get bigots. Um, and I always say little knowledge is a very dangerous thing. There were a couple of people I based my character upon, which I would in no way share with you. Um, but yes, um, I remember, I remember as a teenager, that kind of real fear and, um, you know, sort of, horrific reaction to, to, to that community so yeah I drew on memory really and you've you've met a lot of the people here tonight that obviously or you've met them before people that the characters are based on as well you heard their sort of reaction to the film everyone seems very very, very positive and very very proud really of what Matthew and Stephen and all you lot have done rightly so well it's just such um, a unique thing to be part of a film where the people that the, the majority of people are depicting are here and are alive and kicking and are testament to the work they did back in the 80s and it's an honor it's just a real honor to be part of them part of the work they did and they're hugging me you know I think they understand I'm quite nice I'm quite nice really yeah I haven't seen the film yet <laughs> no but yeah they it's been amazing that side of it it's just a you know a real real a privilege real privilege yeah and lastly I have to ask what's it like squaring off with Imelda Staunton well you know babe she's quite scary um, I remember in rehearsals we had a stunt um, rehearsal and Imelda said we don't need a stunt we don't need a stunt man I got a little bit scared at that point but I decided I wasn't going to fight back, so she goes for my neck. I just stand there and kind of whimper, really. So then people break it up, so it's fun. Yeah, but yeah, it was great fun. It's really great fun. Congratulations on the film. Really nice to talk to you. Thank you. Thank you.